understanding the resource database. This is about the UVM configure DB. A resource is a parameterized container that holds arbitrarily data. Resources can be used to configure components, supply data to sequences, or enable sharing of information across disparate, disparate parts of the test bench. They are stored using scoping information so their visibility can be constrained to a certain part of the test bench. You can put any data type into resource database, have another component retrieved it later at some point in simulation, which is a convenient feature to have. A resource primar primarily has the following field. Name, the name by which this resource is stored in the database. The same name has to be supplied to retrieve it later. Value, the value that should be stored in the database for the given name. Scope, a regular expression that specifies the scope over which this resource is visible to other components in the test bench. Type. The data type of the object as his, this resource contains. It can be a string, int, virtual interface, class object, or any other valid system variable data type. The global resource database has both a name table and a type table into which each resource is entered so the same resource can be retrieved later by name or type. Multiple resources with the same name or types are stored in a queue and hence those which were pushed in earlier have more precedence over those places later. In the image above, if a request to retrieve an item of a type string is made, the queue is trans traversed from the desk from front to desk <clears throat> sorry, from front, front, from front to back, and the first occurrence of an object of string type will be returned. Now, consider the case where the items 2, red, and 3, blue, and the queue have the same scope, at get n, get n, up, get underscore by underscore time method is called for particular scope. Then item two, red, will be returned since the sit earlier in the queue. Resources are added to the pool by calling set and they are retrieved from the pool by get by name or get by by type. Another interesting feature is that resource pool and data contains a history of get. Whenever a component uses the above method to retrieve an object, it will be recorded both for successful and failed gets, which can be dumped at the, at the end of a simulation. This can be a very good tool during debug. Next is we can UVM Configure Database. The UVM Configure Database, the UVM has an internal database table in which we can store values under a given name and it can be retrieved later by some other test bench component. The UVM underscore configure underscore DB class provides a convenient interface on the top of the UVM underscore Resource underscore DB to simplify the basic interface used for UVM underscore component interfaces. Note that all the functions are static and must be called using the colon colon scope operator. Such a configuration database allows us to store different configuration settings under different names that could potentially configure database uh, test bench components when required without modifying the actual test 
bench code. For example, to turn on the functional coverage for an, an agent, we would simply have to give the path to that agent and set a variable within the configuration database to value 1. The agent could check for the value under this variable and start collecting coverage if it is turned on. It's sad. Use the static function of the class uvm underscore config underscore db to set a variable in the configuration database. In the example below, set function will set, will set a variable of name cov underscore e enable at the path uvm test top menv mapv agent 2 with value 1. Use of the set will be create a new or update an existing configuration setting for field name in inst name from cntxt. The setting is made at cntxt with the full scope of the set being cntxt dot inst underscore name. If the cntxt is null, then the complete scope of the getting information will be provided by inst underscore name. Note that in the last example of a cntxt is this. It will be substituted by the path to the current component, which in this case is UVM test top MEMV MAPB agent. As explained above, the full scope becomes UVM test top MEMV MAPB agent asterisk. Get. Use this static function to get the value of variable given field name from the configuration database. Remember that the value will be returned only if the scope is true. For example, you had to set the variable field by field underscore name mcfg as scope m uh, uvm test star as memv m function underscore c o v then you have to give the same score or a score that is true for the expression to retrieve the value under field name cntxt is a starting search concatenated with the instant score name gives the entire score exists checks if a value for field name is available in the inst name, using component cntxt as a starting point, if the field name does not exist at a given scope, the function will return a zero. The spell underscore check R can be set to one to turn spell checking on if it is expected that a field should exist in the database. Weight modified method. View of this task will block execution of the statement following this until the configuration setting names and field names specified as scope cntxt dot inst underscore name is changed. Convenient tasks. There are few type defined aliases for the following primarized versions of config underscore uh, uvm com underscore config underscore db. Next is com uvm config underscore db example. The uvm configuration database accessed by the class uvm config db is a great way to pass a different object between multiple test bench component. Method. <clears throat> there are two primary functions used to put and retrieve the items from the database, which are set and get, respectively. Rules. Create or update a config settings for field name in instant name from cntxt. The setting is made at cntxt with a full scope 
been cntxt dot institute underscore name. If cntxt is null, the instant name provide the complete scope information of the setting. Field name is the target field. Both instant name and field name may be globed style of a regular expression style expressions. Setting from the hierarchy, curve higher levels have a higher precedence. Setting from the same level of a hierarchy have a last setting within the semantic. How to debug UVM underscore config underscore DB. The best way understand how the combination of a CNTXT institute underscore name and the field name works is by enabling the command line debug UVM underscore config underscore DB trace switch for UVM that dumps information on all the set and get calls with a simulation. So example, we will look at how to test bench environment behaves set and get method are called from different hierarchies. One, test and environment, ENV. To understand how config DB evaluate expressions, we will set up a small test bench structure with an empty environment as shown below. An expression is set from the test class and retrieved in the environment build phrase. So build phrase, test and env. The case, case one, we set cntxt to null and inst underscore name to uvm underscore test underscore top to indicate that all components in the test can access the item. To keep things simple, we'll put our string item tagged as a friend. Hmm. So it is quite clear that the first argument is cntxt cannot be anything other than a UVM component object. From the following simulation law, we can see that when you plus UVM config db trace is passed as a command line switch, simulation will dump all function calls to set and get in the log. However, the lines of our interest are highlighted in color, the yellow one representing a set core and the green representing a successful get core. The concatenation of a cntxt inst name and field name match for both set and get cores. Hence, the database successfully finds and returns the string tags as a friend. Case 2. Here, we'll make a slight modification to the set method. Last of the code being the same. The first argument is cntxt get this pointer while instant name is empty and still we get the same path uvm test to top friend after concatenation. 2. Test env and to agent. Now we will expand the environment to have a couple of agent to make things more interesting. If we run the code again, the new agent in place, you'll find that both agent also found the string tags as a friend one. The simulation log. The recommended practice. The setting in config underscore db is visible by only those elements that can evaluate to the same expression as the set core. If we keep a global scope such as a UVM test name, then all components will be able to retrieve the setting. However, this poses a potential problem of collision of the field name with the same scope as well as retrieval of the settings via an intended get calls. Hence, the recommended practice is to make the setting available to only those components 
that are really that really require the settings to to function. In a similar way, during get calls, component should look for settings that are available to them. The expression that is sent to be set that is set in config underscore db is a UVM test top friend based on the set function core. Config db result show the expression evaluated by the get method core. If both of these expression match or satisfy the globe properties, it is considered to be a match. In the case below, all the three GAN method calls failed simply because the expression each of the component tried to get is different from the expression that is set. In the above case, the setting was made available only to the agent and hence in the environment was not able to retrieve it at each level. To make the setting available to the environment, we will make another set call just for the environment. If you put a star like M underscore EMV star, then the settings will be made available to all the components in the environment. A few examples on set and get methods were illustrated in the previous article. Now we will see more combination of expression used to set and get settings from the UVM uh, from config underscore db and see the result of the such operations on the same data test bench structure with two agents in the environment. Set versus get leisured. To recap, a setting of a setting with field name friend is set to the different cntxt and the inst name in the config db. This is obtained by both agent and the environment using the using the get method with different cntxt and the inst name combinations. If the get call is successful, the cell is highlighted in the pale green, else it is highlighted in pale red. The first column of the first column in the table shown below is for the test class that sets the field friend with a given cntxt and instant underscore name. All subsequent columns represent different components that try to get settings from config underscore db, which in our example is the environment and to agent. Thank you for time today.